Hey, I'm Garrett. I'm Jeff. I'm Josh. And I'm Luke. And we're all all things new. We are so excited for Family Life Radio to be playing New Man, and we hope that it encourages you and it blesses you, and it just talks about the restoration and the redemption of Christ through His love and His mercy. Thank you guys so much. This new song, it is called New Man, and uh, it just really amazing that you guys are going to add it and thank you so much that's just uh it's really unbelievable you know just a bunch of kids from florida just getting this opportunity and it's uh it's pretty breathtaking and unbelieving and uh it's been a dream of mine since i was 10 years old and i looked over to my dad and uh i was like man i want to i want to play music you know my dad's been in the country industry his whole life and uh, he's like yeah you know and he starts laughing like <laughs> whoever thinks you know but that just kind of leads me just to kind of just talk about this story. I feel like God has given us each our own story. And and until we can turn around and just tell the ultimate story of Jesus Christ through our own story and and glorify him, because that's the reason we do this. That's the reason we are together in all things new is just to magnify his name. And um, so when I was two years old, my uh, biological father left me and my uh, mom, who was pregnant with my youngest sister at the time, and I had an older sister. And uh, I just struggled with the thought through a little kid, like, how could this happen? Is, was I not good enough? Did, was, was there something wrong with me? Why, why would he do that? And I just struggled with a longing for just this love of a, of a, of a father. And um, I remember when I, my mom remarried to my stepdad. It was really great in the beginning, like unbelievably great. And, uh, then we just really hit just a really rough patch. My sister, my oldest sister, was heavily, heavily addicted to drugs at the time. And uh, we moved down to Florida, and things just got crazy. Home was just chaotic, and home was just broken, and it was violent. Their marriage was broken on both ends of the marriage. And coming home was just like a disaster for me. And I, I, I remember just walking and seeing my dad's truck and just like, man, I don't want to go in there. There was times and moments in my life where we would get in arguments and the arguments would be so intense, I would literally be scared of my life and didn't know what to do and how to handle that at a young age. <clears throat> and there was times through that where we would pass each other in the halls in, in our house and sitting in the same living room, kind of how we are right now in this cozy little living room atmosphere and not talk to each other. And it's really hard on someone who's 11, 12 years old and not understanding why his stepdad is not talking to him for days on end. So it really took a toll on me. And uh, my dad ended up leaving and I was just raised by my mom in a single family, single single mom, pretty much my whole life. Even though my stepdad was there, he was re- wasn't really there. Then um, ended up me and my mom getting evicted a few years ago and kind of just really just the story of this band and how like we're just such a family and we have each other's back through everything and it's just amazing to have a family of brothers in Christ and uh, in this very moment I live with Jeff and his family and it's just so amazing to have that home and somewhere I can call home and uh, even though me and my mom aren't together we have a great relationship and I've really <clears throat> have really learned to find out that no matter how much I long for that great earthly father that the perfect father is Jesus Christ and um, that because of him, we are perfect. And because of him, we are beautiful. Because of him, we are whole and we are worthy. And um, we are a new creation in him. And he has turned our ashes into life, like this song says. And um, I'm just so thankful for that. And it's really amazing because at this very moment of my life, my sister is nine months clean from a drug addiction. Yeah. I just became an uncle from that, from my oldest sister. And uh, at this very moment, I talk to my stepdad every day. I talk to my stepdad, I just called him right before we left uh, LA and just told him I loved him. And we have the greatest relationship we've ever had. And God has truly, truly redeemed that and truly restored that relationship in my heart and relationship with that. And it's unbelievable. And, I, and I, I feel like God is still working on me and my biological dad. But I believe through Christ that that can get renewed. That's right. And uh, it's just an honor just to be here. And I just want you guys to know that uh, Christ loves you and that we are a new creation in him. 
And I know that this song talks about my story, but um, I feel like there's so many people that struggle with that thought that they're not good enough or they don't feel loved, but that because of Jesus Christ, we are made new. And uh, so yeah, we're gonna play, it's called New Man. And seriously, thank you guys so much for listening. Yeah. 